another quick video on a tool or a flashlight I just picked up. This is the Husky swivel head work light, 800 lumens. It's got three modes, high, medium, low. None of that red or flashing nonsense, which is nice. Then you have the swivel head and the rotating hook on the back and then the magnets. It's a three year limited. It is a lithium, what is it? Lithium ion rechargeable, which is cool. And here you have a number up top, right there. And this is the back of the box. switch um, I picked this up because I always wanted one of those lights that uh, well I didn't want it but uh, I kind of needed it the other night when I was working on a car where I didn't have a light but somebody loaned me a light um, but this one is the type that the folding type that basically you can move around or flexible type I guess you can say when I first got it, I thought he, <clears throat> he folded on the middle here like most of them do. This one does not, and I thought that kind of sucked when I first thought about it, or took it out. But then I realized, actually, that's a good thing, that it does fold on the bottom here and not in the middle. Because what that means is that you can have it on the lower side of the car, and then you can install it or um, put it on the body of the car this way and you don't have this long piece sticking out you know under the car if you're on Jackson's you may only have so much space but this because it's so far back it allows you to use it underneath or in a more limited space which is kind of cool actually if you think about it <clears throat> so this one swivels it doesn't swivel 360 degrees that's where it stops and same for the other side that's where it stops which is fine um, the one thing you gotta note it is plastic so you definitely don't want to run over it because then that's not a good thing um, it'll probably break on you it's got this hook on here which is nice but I do wish it was uh, metal so you really do have to be careful not to bang this too much or you will break it um, it's not something I guess I had to use in the past so maybe that's not such a bad thing anyways on the back you do have uh, charging four charging lights here let me open the uh, port and it is a USB port not a micro USB which is nice uh, I think on the description on the Home Depot website they say micro USB but it's not it is uh, so you can see a USB-C here is the cable that comes with it USB-C so that's kind of nice um, I already have a cable that I charge uh, stuff with um, the one with the three different connectors so that still works I just charge it uh, right before I started using it last night and actually it feels really nice it is plastic but it's it's not too bad now if you're someone who just throws your stuff around this may not last you that long but I like the feel of the button so that's what you got on the lights so that's the highest mode which is 800 lumens and I believe the next one this one is 400 let me double check yep 400 that's what it says right there and then you have a hundred right there and again it shows you the lights every time you press it and then it's off which is nice I hate that uh, strobe lights and SOS lights on a regular flash light where you don't actually need that so there it shows you the charge I did use it for a little bit last night and there you go it's kind of nice so I like this, uh, I did, those are the four magnets on the bottom, 
probably not the strongest but you can go the other way too so both ways which is nice so if you think about it I mean now I'm able to uh, say use it under the car and then just kind of swivel this around towards the top and I have a light in there I always want to get one of these but I finally you know I was at Home Depot and I saw it well actually I was looking at the Home Depot site for flashlights and I want to see what they had there and this is the one I saw that I thought it was kind of neat so I went and got it there's another one that has like 300 lumen it's the round type which is metal and it does fold on the middle here but I like this one I just picked it up you know without thinking too much about it so I hope that helps actually somebody I had a, a gift card from there so that's why I also went to Home Depot uh, because I was looking at the other ones that Harbor Freight, but since I had that um, card, so I just picked this up. And actually, I, I do like it. I like the feel of the button. It feels good. You don't have to press it super hard or extra hard. As you can see, it's really easy to press. And it's in the back, so it's not in the front, like a not awkward place. So And it's already facing that way, so that's kind of nice. I mean... Just a short video on that because I didn't see too many um, videos on it. And one more thing, one thing I almost forgot to mention. If you look at it, it's an Easy Red company. So it's made by Easy Red, which is I thought was kind of interesting because I went to the website and my um, ad blocker completely blocks their site. It said there's something wrong with that side and it's been blocked. So I can't even look at their uh, website for this. I did look on Amazon. I, didn't, I found some other ones, but nothing like this one. But there you go. It is an easy red. And I do have those um, ratchets from them, which I like. So just another little thing to note on that. CLB right there. Let me see if I can get you a close up just so you can see it. So it is plastic, but it is a little harder plastic. It's not like your flimsy plastic. It feels good. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much it. And you get that manual and the uh, uh, USB plug, and that's about it. So I hope that helps, and we'll see how, how well it lasts, because um, as long as I don't run over it, I guess I'll be good.